So, hi, my name is uh, Ashwini Goyal, and uh, I work with SAP in India, uh, SAP Labs. And uh, today I'm going to talk about Open UI 5. Uh, uh, it's a new uh, JavaScript UI library from SAP. Uh, it's open source. Uh, so it's built over open source components, and this is the way uh, SAP wanted to, to give back to the community. And it's a partial license, free for commercial usage too. So it is more than 200 UI controls, uh, both for mobile as well as for desktop. It's 100% responsive, uh, runs on any device, any machine. Uh, uh, it supports MVC, data binding, and templating, uh, and a lot of other features. So you'll love it. Um, so it supports the most current browsers and devices, um, uh, and it's enterprise grade. So let me talk about uh, that a little bit later. So uh, this is the uh, uh, small demo. Let me show you. Um, hopefully, you are able to see it. Yeah. So uh, this is the launch pad. Uh, why does it? OK. Interesting. So uh, if you see, it will automatically readjust itself, uh, you know, depending upon the size. So let's say I make it smaller, smaller, 100% responsive. Let me open some uh, apps. Let's say I open my timesheets. So uh, this is how it would look on mobile. You see the hamburger button automatically appears. And if I make it full screen, I run it on desktop, it automatically disappears and adjusts. Let me go back to this slide. So uh, this year, one of the applications built with OpenUI 5 also won the Red Dot uh, uh, Communication Design Award. And there was one more uh, Red Dot win on uh, uh, UI 5, and that is related to Fairy 2. So Fairy 2 is not yet implemented on OpenUI 5, but it will be there very soon. So what's enterprise great? Uh, 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 it supports internationalization and uh, right to left, uh, uh, as, uh, you know, uh, it supports accessibility, uh, has debugging support. Um, uh, the API remains stable over the time, of course, because enterprise users uh, are very specific about that. Uh, it has the capability to theme the application very easily. So uh, you can change colors. Uh, very easily just by changing one variable. It uses less in the background, so it's pretty easy to you know uh, configure all the shades and less. And instead of images, it uses icon fonts. So even the fonts get uh, colored, uh, uh, and the images also get covered, colored. So you can change anything and everything about it very easily. So there is a theme designer available uh, for that. Uh, let's try it out. So I have some documentation uh, also, and some code in UI5, uh, uh, of uh, NJSBIN. So here's the developer guide. You could go to openui5.hana.ondemand.com. And uh, uh, so just check out the developer guide. It's, uh, let me increase the size. I don't think you can view it. OK. Um, there are uh, there is the API reference. Uh, you can try out the demo apps here. Um, you can check the you know different controls which are there. Um, there's a you know example code also available. So you have menus. Fifteen more seconds. So you can pull to refresh the list. So of course this is not touch enabled, but you could uh, you know pull to refresh this Three, list. Two. One. So thanks. Thank you, Ashwani.